you know what? We could run this right now. But let's do something even nerdier. Let's do this. Let's create a script to run our Java file. Hey everybody, it's Megan T. Garrett here, and I'm bringing another Q&A video to you tonight. And this is going to be the first one where I'm actually going to be doing something than just sitting here and talking. It's, it's going to be majority talking, but there'll be more to watch. One of the first ones I wanted to do after answering everybody's questions was a programming video. So that's what I'm going to do this evening. I'm going to take you inside the computer and show you how I program a simple Hello World in Java. I'll be doing it with Windows 10 and I installed a Ubuntu um, instance. So it will be done basically in Linux, which is the easiest that I know how to program in. Windows has some complications and I'm not very versed at recording in Mac. So I'm hoping that the terminal will come out okay. I can't use like alt space to actually maximize the window. So let me know if that comes out okay. But we're gonna be in the terminal, we're gonna make a simple Java program and I'm gonna go through how I basically use my screen reading software which is called JAWS, which stands for Job Access with Speech. It's been around for many, many years. I used to use it back in the fifth grade when I was first introduced to it, so I've been using it for at least 20 years. It's an excellent program, and I'm gonna show you how I basically will listen to what I'm typing in, how I go through the code line by line, word by word, character by character, and how I read the output in the terminal. So let's go ahead and get inside the computer and get started. Okay guys, so welcome to inside my Windows computer. Um, I'm using my gaming headset because I feel that will be easier to record this with. And I'm also going to be using an external keyboard on my lap. So I don't have to reach forward for the laptop. So all it has to do there is program and record. So let's start by first opening, opening an Ubuntu. Search box edit. The Ubuntu app. Unavailable text area. Okay, so... Let me explain something about how JAWS works. JAWS works by using mainly two modes, PC mode and JAWS mode. PC acts like um, basically tabbing through elements, so it can go through buttons, radio buttons, tabs, tables, stuff like that. JAWS mode gives it more freedom just to read text that's on the screen, kind of like if it's like scanning for text, it's more freedom like the mouse cursor. Because I'm in my Ubuntu terminal right now, and first thing I want to do is actually slow down JAWS so everybody can understand what he's saying. Slower, slow, slower, slower, slower. Okay, so if I just arrow up and down. Gary the desktop dash O Q P K V zero eight colon tilde dollar exit. Gary the desktop dash O Q P K V zero eight colon tilde dollar. It kind of reads off the last commands and everything and reads the stuff before the dollar sign. But if I do like a, uh, uh, what directory I'm in, it doesn't read it out. So I have to. JAWS to PC. Ja put JAWS where PC is and then go to JAWS. JAWS. JAWS mode. And then. Slash home slash Garrett. Then it reads out what the terminal actually, the terminal output. So I'm in slash home slash. PC. Slash Garrett. Garrett. Okay. So to begin a program, let's create a directory first called my proj. Oh, um, let me turn this on real quick. Characters. Characters. So you can hear what I'm typing. M K D I R space M Y. P R O J enter. Okay, did we actually get it? Let's see. Jaws. Gary the desktop dash O Q P C L S space Z one one zero dash one enter. Jaws to PC. And Jaws. Blank Gary the my proj. My proj, there it is. So let's go into that directory. I love autocomplete. Okay, are we in that directory? P W D enter. Jaws to Jaws slash home slash Gary slash my proj. PC. Okay, so now let's create a new Java file T -O -U -C -H with the touch command. Space. Let's call it Hello World. H E L L O W O R L D period J V A enter. Okay. L -L space dash one enter. Jaws to PC Hello World dot Java. Okay, there's our new file. PC. So to use uh, to edit these files, V I is the best v -I program for me. Space H tab enter. Okay. Land. Space. And I can tell when the window doo -doo -doo is making that noise. I'm basically in a VI window. So I'm just going to hit I for insert. I. 
which turns me into insert mode in VI. And let's just start uh, typing this class out. First, I'm going to put the package. P A C A A G E space and Y P R O J semicolon and enter. Okay, now the class. C L A S S space A E L L O W O R F D space left brain enter. And the function statement. P U B L I C S T A T I C O R D space A I N left parent. S E R I N G space A R S left brain right rack right pair space left brace. Okay. Class hello. So, blank package my proj semicolon. So to do this, I'm basically arrowing up and down with the arrow keys. So I'm reading line by line. Blank package my proj semicolon. Blank blank. Public static class hello world left brace. Public static void main left parent string arcs left bracket right bracket right parent left brace. Public. Okay. So now if I go to the top of the file back, back, back. and hit home. My proj. Now if I hold down the control key and hit the right arrow key, it will read it by word. Space, my proj semi, my pro package, my proj semicolon, my proj space, class, hello world, left brace, public, static, void, main, left parent string, left parent string, arcs, left bracket, right bracket, right parent, left brace, space. And if I go to the top of the file again, left, pack, 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 semicolon, and you hit just the right arrow key, it will read by letter. A. P A C A H E space M Y P R O J semi space 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 blank class and that one you have to arrow down to get to the next line. Pu 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 so let me go to D hit a right a right arrow key until I get to the end of my I line. Space 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 enter. Okay, now we're gonna put in our blank. printout statement, and I'm gonna purposely put an error in S here. Y S T M period O U T period P R I N T L F left quote A E L L O space W O R F D exclaim quote right pair semicolon enter and let's end our class right race enter right race enter right race right race system dot out dot print left parent quote hello world quote right parent semicolon okay so if you heard there it said system dot out that print full of that's another thing that Jaws struggles with if it's not camel case which means that every word in the Basically, the compound word starts with a capital letter for each word. If it doesn't, it tries to take all those letters and say the word so poof. Java people will know what error I put in here. So that is basically your hello world program. So we will push escape, escape to exit edit mode and then save it. Colon, w, enter. Error the desktop. Okay, so let now try to compile our Java program because you have to compile before you can run. Now we do that with J -V -A -C. Java C. Space, H -tab. Enter. Did it? Jaws to PC. Did it work? Blank, blank. Gary the desktop. Gary the desk. Hello world. Java. Jaws to PC. Oh come on. Jaws to PC. One error. One error. Oh no! What could possibly be wrong? Location colon variable out of type print stream. Variable out of type. Symbol colon method print of left parent string right parent carrot system dot out dot print of left parent quote hello world quote right parent semicolon hello Gary the desk. So I'm reading the output for this screen and hello world dot Java colon five colon error colon cannot find symbol. So Hello world Java colon line five colon can't find symbol system dot out dot print left pair can't find system dot out that print string which is the ta um, in taking argument and the reason is is because print l f doesn't actually exist it's print l n so let's go fix that enter okay g g g g to get to the top of the file package my blank class help public static system dot out dot print s we have to be, okay, now I'm going to push I, I for insert. S -E 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 Till I'm to the letter. F. I push backspace to delete the F. N. N. Now escape. See. L T. N I P -E period. So let's check that line. P R I N T L N N quote left parent pop system dot out dot print left parent quote hello escape. Okay, so let's save Colon, again. W, enter. And you possibly heard it say their end twice. Sometimes VI and JAWS disagree with each other. All right, so let's just try to compile it again. And we didn't get any output, so let's check the LS. Hello world.class. That means we were successful in um, compiling our file. And you know what? We could run this right now. But let's do something even nerdier. Let's do this. Let's create a script to run our Java file. So I, cr 
Oops. Land escape. Hold Q. Enter. Never mind there. The desktop. So I'm going to create a script to run our file, and it's basically a .sh file, which is a shell file, bash, whatever. Um, so we're going to open that up. Okay, so let me just bang this out, like literally, um, number, bang. Okay, you need that at every type of uh, sh file, and now the java command. J-A-V-A space M-Y P-R. Okay, slash A E L L O W O R L D. So that's all we should need. You don't put the dot class at the end of the file. Java knows where to look for it. So let's Blank. go through that file. Number slash min slash s h. Blank Java my project slash hello world. Okay, so let's exit out of this. Escape colon w enter. Get the desktop. All right, change the C H M O D space seven 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 space R U N M enter. I'm just changing the permissions of that file. So I can run it. Don't panic. I don't use 777 all the time. I know that's bad practice. So let's see if now our program will run by using our run proj script. Here slash R U N tab enter. And JAWS to PC. check JAWS to see if it worked. Hello world. Hello world. It Hello worked. PC. So let's do a little one more edit just to have fun enter. some fun here. Blank number blank I E C A O space quote. R E A D W S S T R space E G A T G A R R E T T quote seven enter echo quote ready master mega carrot quotes Java my project A V X F Y O R F D space space and enter E A O quote the E space R E O E space S T R S E G A T G A R R E T T quote seven enter echo quote we are done master mega carrot quote semi blank job blank echo is escape colon dot you enter carrot the desk here slash you enter Jaws to PC. We are hello ready, Master Mega Garrett. Hello world. We are done, Master Mega Garrett. Garrett at so, desktop PC. So that is a very short intro into how I program. So I hope I've shown you enough how I navigate by word, character, and line. How I basically use PC mode and Jaws mode to navigate, and and how I mainly um, use PC mode in the file to edit the code itself, and how I use Jaws in the terminal to read the output. So that is basically the basis of how a blind person programs. I can use IDEs like Eclipse and other programs like that, but I find the terminal to be one of the best. Welcome back. Well, I hope you enjoyed this shorter video, I think, of uh, programming a simple hello world in Java. Now, I'm a software engineer, that is my career. So I deal with this kind of code. I deal with a lot of other kind of programming like in C++ and I do Jenkins and I do a few other things. But I basically use the same principles with my screening software to do everything in code. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're new to the channel, welcome. My name is Terry. Um, this was a Q&A video, and I also do gaming, fitness, and firearms. So if you like this content, please subscribe. Please hit the notification bell. I am started posting a, a videos again a, a little under a month ago, and I'm getting at videos out there about twice a week on different subjects. I think we have some more gaming videos coming for you, and I definitely want to start my first um, couple firearms videos. Those are going to be brand new, and I hope you enjoy those. So I hope you guys have a great rest of your evening, and we will talk to you later.